excited because we're going to Hong Kong. So I'm gonna take you with me. So amazing news. We just checked into our flight with Cafe Pacific and we've been upgraded to business class. I'm very excited about this because this will only be the second time I've flown business. So um, I'm excited to see what the seats are like, how much food and drink we're going to get. We're going to go and check out the lounge, but apparently it's only a temporary one. Um, so it might not be as amazing as the one in Hong Kong, but I'm very excited. I like to sit in the special seats. I'm so excited right now. Do you know why? Because I'm going through the fancy door. Not the regular door that I'm usually in, the posh door. Are you excited to go through the posh door, Maya? It's very excited. Hong <laughs> Kong, here we come. The cabin, as you can see, it's pretty empty. Very nice. Are you relaxing in your seat, darling? Mm -hmm. So, we've both got our own screens. Wait, how can. Is this my screen here? And then that's your screen. Oh, it folds out. Oh, it folds out. Okay. I was going to say, that's awfully far away. Um, got a little pocket here that you can put your bags in. Little, little Gucci bag pocket. Oh no, it doesn't fit a Gucci. Um, are there any amenities? Probably not because it's such a short flight. Oh, I think I just had my champagne pocket. And a little cupboard. I didn't realise. Oh. I can't, get, uh, I can't get open. Ah, little headphone cupboard. Oh, and a little mirror. Hello, me. What else is in here? Nothing. I guess you could put a drink in there too. Here, so if you look at myself in bright light, I look kind of horrid. 
fresh but feeling fresh right now. Did a face mask so that's like rejuvenated me and helped for all the alcoholic drinks I consume. We've had about seven. Um, so yeah, so excited. We haven't got any checked baggage so and we've um, we pre-registered last time we came so you can just go straight through the automatic gate so we should be in the city pretty soon. We're gonna head off for lunch so I don't know where we're gonna go so let's see where we end up. Okay so this is the best thing about first class. Look at all the room I have. Really big flat bed, so you can lie down. Just so much room, so much room for my little legs. Flight, as you can see, much much fresher, and the express train has just pulled in. So we're gonna go grab a seat uh, and head into the city and get some lunch, and then we're gonna go check out our hotel. So we're going to see what that's like. Hopefully it's better than the last one. Okay, so we came to the airport a couple of hours ago and our flight was oversold. So they asked us to wait and see if we would get on the next one in exchange for a free upgrade and, and 500 Hong Kong dollars each, which we thought was an amazing idea. So we had to wait and then we had to come back again and again and yeah, so we're going on a later flight now but we'll be flying in business class and I'm about to take you to the Cafe Pacific Business Class Lounge which is apparently one of the best in the world. So I'm super excited and I'm going to show you everything that there is to eat and drink in this lounge because I know I couldn't really do that in Seoul because it was just the temporary one and I was asked not to show it. So I'm going to see you in the lounge. over two stories we're in the upstairs part which you can see is very busy so right now we are just sat at the bar this is the bar having a mickey pay made for me how cool is that now was on the champagne so i'll show you the cocktail here is the drinks menu here at the bar a very nice selection they make cocktails which i'm so excited about I think I might work my way through all of these. Okay, thank you very much. My mojito is here. I'm going to give my mojito a try. Cheers, baby. over there which I'll go and check out in a minute. It's all these magazines. Going to check out some washrooms which I think are showers. <gasps> Here we go. Oh amazing. Proper noodle bar here. Wow I think we need to come and move over to this bit. So let's see what you've got. Ooh, so they've got dandan -dan noodles, wonton noodles and soup, ice vermicelli, ham, fried noodles. Oh, Bobby, you've got buns. So, okay, I'm going to come order some of those in a minute. Condiments for the noodles. Let's see what else is over here. They've got coffee, ice. You know I love my ice. Got fresh juices. Beers and soft drinks, quite a nice selection there. Ooh, some dim sum. Mm. Uh, fried rice. There is soup. Got some soup up there too. So I think I'm going to go grab Niall and uh, we will give the old noodles a try. Some cheese, some dried fruits and crackers. More of the sandwiches from the coffee bar. Different salads, I haven't seen these anywhere else. Ooh, little cakes and little cups, how cute. More soft drinks, fresh juices. What have we got over here? So we've got some pastries and bread. 
Obviously so we've got carrot soup. A pig parmigiana, that's one out. Some rice and curry. And that one's out too. So not a bad selection of stuff. Having an espresso martini made for me. This is pretty freaking badass. Here in the old lounge. So it's quieting down a little bit. We're gonna go and sit over in that little nook before we go back to the middle bar. I told you earlier, because we had to wait two hours to get the next flight, we were given 500 Hong Kong dollars each. Um, which we had the cash, so we could have just changed it back into Korean won. But we decided to spend it on a bottle of champagne each because we have the wedding coming up and when we get back, it's not going to be long till Christmas and New Year. So we thought we'd treat ourselves because we both love a bottle of it. Um, yeah, so we basically got a free upgrade to business and a bottle of champagne each for an extra two hours of our lives, which I think is an amazing deal. So thank you, Cathy Pacific. Okay, so I've been to the noodle bar. So we've got these Dan Dan noodles, which are in this very sweet peanutty sauce. and absolutely delicious. I've already been eating those. We've got the wonton noodles. Those little pork buns. You know I can't get enough of these. These are my jam. Whenever I come to Hong Kong, I am obsessed. He's got himself a Pinot Noir and an ode to black penis. Hang on, I'm going to tour you over to the hot food because it's been refilled. So look, they've got some mac and cheese, num nums. Then they've got this curry and rice, yummy. And they've got this Ooh. yummy soup. And parmesan. And then coffee. Rubbies and soft drinks and things in here. This is the same as before. Well, there's more sandwiches now there. More cheese. So I'm gonna take you over to the shop. I would show you. They have their own little private shower shower rooms with shampoo conditioner shower gel very fancy shower by the looks of it and a rain shower little toilet in here sure leak amenities all right i'm my flight is boarding literally right now so i'm gonna cheers you with this margarita and say goodbye and i will see you on the plane cheers guys same place that we were last time but this time we're right at the very front so now. yeah so we've already got our shaft not that we're going to probably have enough um up at the bar in the in the lounge but free champagne so cheers for that um so the seat is exactly the same as when we came out so little control thing for the telly there's a little light this thing is actually really good. You can push this back, you can push this back, and you can go look completely flat, which is only a three and a half hour flight, but it's nice if you want to get some rest. Per personally, I want to be able to eat and drink as much as I can, and watch some films, and I'll sleep at home, because I have a lot of time on my hands. And we've been given our dining menu. It's the welcome page. Ooh, bumpy. No, that's the alcohol. You missed, missed the food. Woo! 
Okay, so to start, there's a smoked duck breast with caramelized apple and marinated barley, mixed salad with kalamata olives and tomatoes, olive oil and balsamic vinegar. And then for our main course, we have the choice of stir-fried prawn, garlic chili sauce, choice some carrot and steamed jasmine rice, which I'm imagining Niall's gonna have. There's a bibimbap, which there's no chance I'm gonna eat. I can eat that in Korea any old day. And a roasted corn-fed chicken breast with spinach, carrot, potatoes, and Madeira sauce. I love Madeira sauce, so I'm gonna have that one. To finish, we have cheese, seasonal fruit, or ice cream. I'm imagining I will be having cheese and ice cream. And then bread selection, coffee and tea. So here's the drinks menu. There are fresh juices, oh coconut water, soft drinks, coffee, tea, I might actually have a Hong Kong style milk tea at some point, hot chocolate and next page. As it's dinner time this time round we've got an alcohol menu. So this is the champagne that they offer, it's the same one we had on the way out. We have a Latour Chardonnay and a Helderberg Sauvignon Blanc. Which I might actually try this time. Red wine wise, they have a dolcetto and a Shiraz and a dessert wine. And they also have cocktails and aperitifs. So they have gin, rum, vodka, martini, campari, sherry. They do a Bloody Mary and a screwdriver. You know I like their Bloody Mary. Whiskies, Pumpy again. Cognac, liqueurs, beer, and then they have two signature drinks. This is their, oh my god, their alcoholic one. It's making me sick. <laughs> um, a refreshing combination of champagne and drambuie with the zest of orange and lemon. I think that's the drink that the Queen has. She definitely drinks a cocktail made with drambuie. I forget what else is a drink. It's something else with drambuie, so yeah, I'm gonna try this. Uh, and then that's just the Chinese. So, not a bad menu, lots of nice drinks. So, we're excited for them to start. Okay, something. so this is the coolest thing about business class. Watch this. Mm. Oh. It's a bit slow getting started. But here I go. And ta -da! Whee! Oh, I would love a blanket, thank you. Now I'm all comfy and cozy and vertical. Pretty bad, that's. Thank you. So look, this is different from the flight out. They're coming around with a very nice drinks trolley. So, it's all the options, glasses, ice, wines, beers, nice warm nuts. What a nice start to the flight. So I'm just getting into my movie. They've already given me my placement and it's time for a drink before dinner. Niall's got a Latour. A Latour Chardonnay? How's it drinking? I think he likes it. I've got a Bloody Mary and these warm smoked nuts. I do enjoy a smoked nut. And also a Bloody Mary. Okay, so the first course of dinner has arrived. So there is a smoked duck and barley salad and then a little side salad with some calamata olives then I got some garlic bread and I forget what this was but it's another kind of bread roll. Got some very nice fancy balsamic and olive oil dressing, some butter and then I've also got the signature Cafe Pacific cocktail. Um, with champagne, drambuie, and then bitted peels, which is delicious. So I'm gonna get tucked into this bad boy. Okay, so our second part of the main course is here. I'm having 
chicken with potatoes, spinach and carrots, more champagne, and I got some more bread too. And down the Nile, here's some spicy, spicy prawns with bok choy and rice, and a glass of the old red. Look at him go. Even Nali's into the photos, so we're gonna get tucked into this. Okay. I'm pretty full already, but we've moved on to the the cheese and fruit platter at the end of the meal. We've got a glass of Sauvignon Blanc. They didn't actually tell me what the cheeses were, so I guess we'll eat them and see. Last course is up. Hagen dazs cookies and cream for dessert, Bailey's and ice, and a cappuccino. What did you get, baby? Some Hagen dazs Strawberry Hagen dazs And what are you drinking? What are you drinking? Yeah, some champagne. Champagne? Treating yourself, are you? He's very spoiled, my hubby. loved flying business it's been absolutely amazing it's only well this would be my third time but second and third time via cafe pacific i've always been interested to know like what happens on a business flight what do you get for free so i hope you've enjoyed my review uh watch me in the next vlog more coming up soon